The position of local council one and local council two councillors has been in limbo since 2007 when the constitutional court nullified the election of village and parish local councils and declared that new ones should be elected under the multi-party political order. Now the local government minister, Adolf Mosige, says the elections can now be held in two years' time. The laws were not consequently amended on time to enable the electoral system of local councils to conform to the new multi-party political system. So the challenge in court took about two years. We finished it. An enabling law allowing the elections was passed in 2010, but no elections were held. Mosige said the Electoral Commission's estimates at 500 billion shillings put off the ministry from the process. He said he will table a bill in Parliament this month that will enable the elections to take place. And we think that the cost will reduce to about 20 billion shillings. The Minister of Finance has already confirmed that once that bill is passed into law, they will get that money, give it to Electoral Commission, and as soon as the law is passed, local council one and two elections will be held. The minister also said the government has procured bicycles for at least 52 districts so far and was looking for more money to cover the remaining 59 districts. This 8 billion could not be accommodated in the budget, so we'll have to wait for the coming financial year to have these funds in the budget. The first attempt to procure 70,000 bicycles for local council officials ended in a scandal in 2011. Former local government permanent secretary John Kashaka and five other officials were convicted in July this year for causing financial loss of over 4 billion shillings. Moses Sakena, NTV Tonight.